Welcome back everyone, Kremlin Archer here, time for some more Cataclysm, Dark Days Ahead. So I've done a little bit of work um, since last time you were here, I, as you can probably see here, I just got done reading and got our mechanics level to 2. Um, but more importantly, come on, oh, shift, there we go, um, I got our tailoring skill up a little bit. I have done a few things, what else have I done? I made a new backpack for us. I believe we also made a new pair of cargo pants, although I could be wrong about that. Um, but most importantly, I have made a new weapon. I have made a makeshift glaive, which hits harder than our nail bat that we had. Because I realized that we had a lawnmower that was hanging out and I was like I bet a lawnmower has blades in it and it did so then we so I made a makeshift glaive I'm quite happy about it to be honest um, let me check in here real quick have we learned how to make any more new boats bolts yet or arrows rather apparently no is the answer alright that's fine let's eat some food um, Got some blueberries, which I guess is probably the best thing to be eating right now. Water. A little bit of water. Alright, we're, we're good. So I, I made a decision. I was trying to decide if... Alright, this just got arrows in it. If it would be a... I, I was torn about burning that other fungal mat, if you remember, when we were out there before. Um, because it's gonna burn down a house if we do it. I've decided that I don't care. We're gonna burn that fungal mat, um, which is over here. We're gonna torch it. It's gonna probably burn the bank down and definitely burn this house down, but, um, I want it gone, so <laughs> that's what we're gonna do. I, although I wanna get some, I wanna get some cash cards here, because, um, we're about to go to, we're potentially going to go to the subway station as well, and the subway station is a place to be when it comes to cash cards. It's also autumn now, it's the second day of autumn as you may notice in the corner. I'm just going to go this way. I'm excited to use our new glaive. We'll see how it turns out for us. Oh, there's a blob. Um, I just would like to go away from the blob, please. Don't really want to attack it right now. Alright, so... I'd like to go up around... So it's a little bit of our fire is apparently still burning out here. Thought it would be burnt out by now, but that's okay. Let's get whatever this is. Can of lemonine soda. It's actually, it actually seems to be burning itself down right now. Alright, so it is raining, so we might not be able to keep this going. So let's go in... I want to just double check in here that we got everything we want. Because this house is about to be... Um, firewood, <laughs> basically. <laughs> Nope, not the filter. Does that ant know I'm here? That ant absolutely knows I'm here. Okay. We're just gonna back up out of that room. Those are both rotten and I don't really care that much about. Um, I deconstruct this furniture. Alright, so let me go here. Oh. Looks like we're gonna take it anyways. Alright, good enough. Whoop, don't step on it. Activate lighter right there. I don't know if it'll be able to burn in the rain, but we'll we'll give it a shot and see what happens here.
trying to run some. No, looks like it. Looks like it isn't gonna. Isn't gonna keep in the rain. So we'll have to come back if it's if it stops raining. We'll come back. So what do we have close to us here? We have a house, a butcher shop, fire station, subway station. So let's go ahead and I guess go to the subway station. I'm really scared about what we might run into out here. Shocker Zombies long is a million miles away, so I'm not that concerned about it. Not gonna worry about the um, rotten stuff. We have a, a ton of bottles at this point, so unconcerned so it's still good let's go ahead and eat something here since we're here um Potato chips, sure. Keep backing up to see if I dropped it on the ground, because it's a tendency to drop stuff on the ground when they're out of space. Still have it. Okay. All right. So much stuff. Oh, so much stuff. All right, that one's broken. All this stuff. Look at it all. Yeah, I was gonna say some of it fell on the ground. Actually, I filled up quite a bit of this already. Let me go ahead and um, that one's broken. Oh, it's empty. All around us. Just move it all. So tempted to go down there. Let me just let me just jump down here real quick. Halfway down the way becomes blocked off. Is that true of all of them? A sheer drop halfway down. No. 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 Okay. All right. Guess we're not going that way. All right. Giant ant is in a fight with a shocking shocker zombie. So that's fine. All right, so there's a fire station directly across the street with what sounds like zombies inside. Oh, hello, feral runner. All right, well, I'm gonna start running, do that, let go of the wheelbarrow. He knows we're here, okay. Come at me, buddy. So this has reach, so we can actually um, attack it from a distance. There are combat boots that fit us. I don't know where the entrance to this house, this place is. Oh, I'm still running. Um. 
Sledgehammer. Don't mind if I do. Uh, no, not right at this moment. History of firefighting. I feel like that might be useful. Alright, so now he uses mechanical winch. No, don't stop. Firefighting zombie. Who knows we're here? I do want to fight him. I'm just kind of, just slightly concerned. Can't quite reach that far. Got him. All right. That's what I was hoping for right there. Fire axe. Dusk mask. Probably don't need. Go without the rest of that stuff. No, don't stop smashing. Oh, there's another one in here. Um, can I operate this? Mm, stop window cleaning this? Yes, we're, stop working the winch. Oh, there's more than one zombie in here. Oh, there's a lot of zombies in here. Well, this is gonna be a problem, probably. <laughs> at least they can only come at us one at a time. All right, turn off safe mode, please. Ripped our backpack. Oh, have we been... We've been bit. All right, well, we're gonna have to gotta stand and fight, unfortunately. Ooh, okay. Um, bandage, Halligan bar. All right, so that was bad. That was real bad. Um, so the question becomes, with our fights here, Bandages won't do it, right? We gotta have like a first aid kit or we can cauterize? I don't remember how to do this. I don't remember how to do this. Oh, how do I do it? Sorry, I gotta look at this thing here real quick. All right, hang on. I gotta, I gotta tab out and rem remind myself how you're supposed to actually do this. <laughs> All right, so I don't remember how. Didn't find quickly how to do the cauterization. Um, but we're gonna go, we're gonna run home, basically. Because I know we have some first aid kits at home. And hopefully we can make it there before this infection gets too bad. So that we don't die. I don't think we're too far from home, so we can do this. All right, come on. All right, let go of it. I need all around me. I need. First, 
I don't have. Oh, there it is. Whew. Thought for a second there. I was like, I don't have a first aid kit. I do. Inventory. All right. Apply. First aid kit. To torso. Apply. First aid kit to left arm. Okay. Whew, that was bad, but it worked out okay. Alright, so let me see... I want to see these this halogen bar thing we picked up. So it has a hammering of two, a prying of four. It has a 25 total plus two, which is similar to our glaive, right? We have a 26 plus 2. But it's flip-flopped. It's more bash, less cut. And we have this fire axe, which is a frickin' 40. There's a plus 2 tree cutting iron. Right, I think we're going to be wielding the fire axe for the time being. Which just makes me kind of bummed that I built the, uh, the glaive, to be honest with you. <laughs> Under the hood. Uh, no, don't drop that. Alright, so wield. It's fire axe. I mean, one of the big things we did there that was messed up. So let's let's take a little bit of a an inventory on what we screwed up there. I was wearing my longbow. Which is causing me a lot of um, encumbrance. So that was probably one of the biggest things. I closed the door behind us so we had no escape route even if I wanted to. Uh, yeah. I'd say those were my top problems. Probably others as well. I do want to go back and loot that stuff. Because there's probably good things in there that I skipped over when I was just in a hurry. So let me just go and go here. And we'll go to here. And we'll move everything over. Where'd you put it all? Where'd it all go? Oh, there it is. I need my arrows. Drop them in there. You know what we should probably do is... Oh, stupid filters. I wish these filters cleared themselves. Um, we should probably get one of these first aid kits and keep it in there. No, not all six. One. There we go. There we go. Alright, so let's go back out, huh? Let's go go I wanna go loot that fireplace. So I need to wield my umbrella since we're wet. It's raining outside. Grab this thing again. This is dumb. <laughs> Alright, this the path we took over here seemed to be fine before, so I think we'll be okay. Hey, an arrow. I mean, we fought for this place. I feel like we gotta loot it now. Oh, there's still somebody in there. Well, let me at least look this real, real quick. Got a thing. 
Go ahead and take the fire extinguisher. Flame resistant suit. Hood. PBA masks, those are, I think, good things. Helmet. Gas mask. Aren't there gauntlets? Yeah, fire gauntlets. Alright, I'm gonna leave the this out here. Wield our fire axe. I'm going to drop not the not the arrows, not the fire axe. Drop the longbow. Rotten cranberry juice. Oh, there's another firefighting zombie. Alright. I'm done with this place for now. Pulps. Pulps, pulps. Alright, we're good. Not gonna risk it. Not gonna not gonna push it. There's probably still some more good stuff in there, but not gonna risk it. Got a house right below us. Subway station. Subway station we can tag as explored because that place is done. Still the gun store just to the north. It's another subway station. A house. I wonder if the problems with the um, getting into the subway is its way of telling me that there actually isn't a subway. There's just a station. I wonder if that's what's going on there. There's a house right here that we could try and get to, though. Fire axe out while we're here. Book of plays. There's a basement. That is both good and terrifying. Mustard. Pot, I don't really care about. Marshmallows, sure. What is that? An AR-15? Okay. No, don't step into the smoke. Okay, there's like a smoker zombie in there. It's a cot here. Take it down? Yes, take it down. We have a cot now. Barbed wire bat. This is like a survivor's home? Yes, take take the funnel down. This is supposed to be like some uh, an ex-survivor house, I guess. Alright, so let go of that. I hear noises? But... I don't hear noises, if that makes sense. Those are rats. Who are hostile. The rat misses the zombie soldier. Alright. Hmm. Not sure I want to tangle with a zombie soldier. Didn't go well for us last time we tangled with a zombie soldier. Let's, um... Oh, it's getting to be morning. Um, let's cut our losses here. I really wish it would stop raining so I could burn these the damn fungus. <clears throat> All 
Where's the spore cloud? Over there. What is this? Pile of ash. Badly burnt fungaloid corpse. All right, so I guess we're not gonna get the, oh, we got just a little bit of fungus here. But maybe we can still burn this, even though it's raining. Stand here while the, nope, can't, can't burn it out right now. Giant ant, we got some wolves that are tracking, another giant ant, all right, let's just go home. Stupid rain. All I wanted to do today was burn some fungus. And I couldn't do it. It's not current season. Okay. Looks like it should be. It's a coyote. Actually, open that door. I want to take a quick look at the quick history of firefighting here. Fabrication skill to nine, but we have to get to seven first. Flame resistant socks, fire axe, all kinds of fire stuff. Cool. All right, I'm gonna stop here for today, and we'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much.